Hi, good afternoon. I'm Ben from Ebony and Ivory Motors. Today I'm going to show you around this 2013 13 plate Volkswagen Golf uh, 2 litre TDI Blue Motion Tech SE. Five door DSG, so it's an automatic gearbox. Uh, one previous keeper on the HPI and V5 document and a full documented service history come with this vehicle. Uh, timing belt and water pump was replaced last year in 2022. Two keys, V5 document, loads of receipts, loads of service history, loads of paperwork. Just arrived in, we'll go through our own VAG specialist workshop, an RAC approved workshop for another service and MOT if required. So let's quickly buzz around it. I'll buzz around it once very quickly. Then we'll have a look at it in a greater detail and give you a better understanding of what we're offering. And also we do use these videos to prep from, so they are brutally honest. See what cosmetics we have to do just to bring it up to our usual retail standard. Okay, starting off at this near side front corner, work our way up and down the panel work from the front to rear. Near side front wing is good, near side front door's good, the off near side rear door's good, and the quarter's good as well. So no cosmetic work required down the near side. Alloys all have light marks to them, but no major damage. Uh, Michelin tyre running about three or four mils of tread. Again, light mark into the alloy. Michelin tyre again. Almost feels new, but we'll say six mil. Just to give you a gauge. Pin dent in the near side rear quarter. Very tiny, remove that one please. Nothing else missed down that near side. Come around the rear bumper. Finish the offside rear bumper in the paint shop. Cause it's got light scuff. A couple of little touch ups in the center section. No damage to the tailgate. Rear screen looks good up along the roof looks good do the same down the offside now so as I say offside rear bumper corner refinish in the paint shop rear quarter is good offside rear door good offside front door good and the wing is good sill has a crease in it so refinish in the paint shop at the bottom or sill yeah sill where the driver's door has a crease so michelin tire again six or seven mil almost feels brand new touch up the door edge when it goes into the paint shop there please you can see that little bit of damage on the sill there just to refinish in the paint shop another michelin tire Running a good five mil a tread at least. Anything else down that offside? Nothing else. Come around the front bumper. No nasty scuffs or scrapes. No damage to the grills, chrome work or lights. A couple of light little chips to touch in on that bumper corner just there when it goes into the paint shop please and a couple of light little touch-ins on the bonnet just there so a couple of touch-ins to do as well all in all for a 10 year old car very tidy no damage to the front screen interior is in good condition the bolsters and the padding is good on the seats. Let's just turn that off. Light wear on the outer edge of the seat there. The stitching on the base is good. There's no rips, tears, burns. There's no odours of any cigarettes. There's no trace of any pet hairs, no drill or glue marks. The interior has just had a good wet back. So I have put a seat cover for when I jump in it. 
made this mistake many a time getting wet. Three rear headrests, three three-point belts, Isofix fitting points to both outer seats, no damage to the reverse of the front seats, and a light grey headlining. Sixty forty split seats, parcel shelf, and some uh, carpet mats. Don't look much, to be fair. A couple of loading chips just to touch in when it goes into the paint shop. So let's quickly pop this seat cover on before I get a wet bottom. Okay, that gives me the protection. So, mileage today, 81,109 miles. Drives very well, does need some fuel. So we've got a DAB head unit, which is factory standard. Media streaming, telephone. Ooh. I think we could have a problem here. Replace that head unit with another one, please. It seems to be misbehaving. Or does it need booting up? No, there we go. Impatient. Should have waited for the Volkswagen screen to come up. Uh, original head unit has got DAB. Media streaming. Okay. Air conditioning. DSG gearbox, auto hold handbrake, original handbooks, Volkswagen infotainment system. We've got cruise control, flat bottom leather bound multifunctional steering wheel, auto lights, electric heated adjustable mirrors and full electric windows. Right, there we go guys. Any questions about this car, please feel free to give us a call. Thank you very much. Cheers, bye bye.